Sleep, also known as the cousin of death, is when the nervous system and most of the body organs are unactive when there's a severely reduced interaction with outside identities. And it's no secret that too much or lack of sleep could have detrimental effects on one's mental and physical health, including depression, anxiety, heart attacks, or even death. This is just a small amount of the plethora of reasons why I shouldn't make this video but the last couple of months have been intrigued in the mere psychology and metabolic reactions of what sleep actually does to the body. So in order to bring this into reality, I'm going to run an experiment in the span of 3 days. I'm gonna have no sleep for the first day, 4 hours of sleep on the second day and 8 hours of sleep on the third day. And at the end of each day, I'm gonna take a physical, BT and creativity test and compare them with the other days and come to a conclusion. 16 at the moment. I'm telling you, I'm in TV because I'm already tired. Today is going to be a long night. <laughs> if I was going to plan all night, it would make sense for me to plan how I'm going to spend the time, and that's exactly what I did. Okay, so this video is actually quite convenient, especially that I have a test tomorrow. And be honest, I haven't really been doing well in school lately, so yeah, I think this is an opportunity for me to get some work done. So let's go, I'll see you later. After 3 hours into the study session, I started feeling drowsy, so I swiftly woke myself back up. So it is finally time for me to take my first test and it is basically going to test how smart or witty I am after having zero sleep, so let's go. So, what flies when it's born, lies when it's alive and runs when it's dead? I don't know, I don't know, I thought I knew about it. Snow. What gets wet when drying? I don't know. A blanket? A towel? Oh. So the more you take out of it, the bigger it becomes. What is it? A hole? A digging hole? A graveyard hole? I don't know. Anything hole, hole like? A pit? Same thing. I just don't know how to speak English. So I said the hole. I'm always somewhere between the ground and the sky. Always far in the distance. Always moving further away. One attempts to conclude that in time, I have no clean motion. The hor horizon horizon only existed when there is light, but direct light kills me. What am I? Kind of shadow, 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 shadow. I need that, I need the heart, I need him. What trouble around the world? Staying in the same corner. I'm, I'm gonna say the globe because that's the only thing I know. And um, let's stamp. Fair enough. Okay, so I just finished the witty test and I think I got like one out of six. What does this say? Well, it could mean that I'm just blunt, stupid, or it could mean that having zero sleep affected my mental toe and the way I think. So, yeah, I'm gonna go off to the gym now and do the one more run and see how it goes. So, Surprisingly finished with a time of 6 minutes 25 seconds and even filmed that documentary with the time remaining. Okay, so I just came from school. If you can tell from my eyes, I am tired. So I'm gonna chuck down this lunch and then and use the rest of my time to go film a video which is going to be coming out on Wednesday. So subscribe and turn on your post notification. Okay, so I just finished another video and I'm going to set my timer to 3 minutes so that I can test my creativity after having 0 hours of sleep. So let's go. Just finished the creativity test and it looked like this. It turned out great and considering the fact that I only had 0 amount of sleep it was okay. At the moment I'm quite tired so I'm just going to go to bed and wake up 4 hours late. This was when it all went downhill. 
but I just woke up from my four hour sleep and I have the worst headache I've ever had in my entire life and this sucks because I have so much things on my to-do list however I'm going to try and go to the gym and complete this challenge and see what I get see you at the gym I did only about 0 0.2 miles and then I started feeling nauseous almost as if I was going to faint and so I did the smartest thing and went back home to get prepared for school. This meant that day two was a complete fail. Day three, the last day of this challenge. With the appalling results of day two, I was not going to let anything stand in my way. So I got myself back up and headed straight to the gym. I completed my workout within six minutes, 10 seconds and decided to smash the workout of my life. I then went home and took another week to test and I absolutely defiled it. Six out of six, I said who? <coughs> I said who? And that's for the creativity test. Wow. Ow.